Old, directed by M. Night Shyamalan, and stars Alex Wolf, Gail Garcia Burnell, and Thomas M. McKenzie. So Old follows a family on a tropical holiday who discovers that the secluded beach where they are relaxing for a few hours is somehow causing them to age rapidly, reducing their entire lives into just a single day. So Old was inspired by a French graphic novel called Sandcastle, a novel that Shyamalan actually received as a Father's Day gift. But he ended up enjoying the premise so much that he purchased the rights for the novel and began to write the script for Old. God damn, I've been waiting on this movie. I mean, I'm pretty sure a lot of us have, but I've been looking forward to this movie for a while. It's probably my most highly anticipated film or my second most highly anticipated film behind Dune. But yeah, I've been really looking forward to it. But after finally receiving my screener, thank God, uh, this movie was just wow. It, it was good. I really enjoyed it. There were almost no missed opportunities when it came to character traits and choices that were made throughout this film. And I really love the fact that Shyamalan was able to think outside the box when it came to all the crazy shit that could go wrong with these characters who are trapped in this situation on this beach. And I mean, of course, you know, it's like, you know, when is Shyamalan not thinking outside of the fucking box like the guy that's all he does but specifically with this situation he really thought about all the different routes and options that these characters would take in this situation and it, and it made for a very entertaining experience lucky for us though and usually this never fails but there's always a couple smart people stuck in these situations they're sort of able to figure out things and just explain things out loud so we the viewers are able to understand the vast effects that happen on this beach when it comes to time and of course there's a lot of visual representations too but there's just a lot of things that they definitely have to explain to sort of keep us up to speed also i really love the cinematography for old like there's a few specific shots of the family when they first arrive on the beach and at this resort and there's a couple shots in particular that sort of tell their own story and it's really cool and also by the way the cinematography is done by mike jalakis who is also known for films like us uh, it follows glass split and even servant the Apple TV original series. So it's kind of safe to say that him and M. Night Shyamalan are pretty cool because they work together on a lot of projects and the guy just really has a good eye for detail. And the movie is also pretty funny as well. Like, I, I don't know, I wasn't expecting it to be this funny. But because there's kids on this beach who are also aging rapidly as well, you get some really funny situations because they're, they're getting much older, faster, but they still have the mindset of children. And because of that, that definitely led to a lot of funny ass moments for me uh, throughout this movie. But I'm not going to go much deeper into detail regarding old because the idea is very straightforward. I mean, people go to an island where they age rapidly and they need to figure out how the hell they need to escape. I think that sums it up very well without me really digging much more into that. I will say though that it's actually very interesting to see all the different theories that the characters come up with to try to make sense of what's happening because there are some very smart people in this group that are stuck on this beach together. But it's so cool because having that intelligence can only last for so long when you are rapidly aging and you think about all the health issues that come along with getting older. And those things actually play a pretty big part here. And of course, you know, if you're a good parent, you know you want your kids to hopefully make it off this beach even if you don't but the thing is there they're not really getting any smarter because you know they're aging yes but they're still aging with the mind of a child so it's like the chances of the later generations actually getting off this island is just decreasing with time instead of their odds getting better which i also thought was a pretty cool you know element of this concept but before i wrap up this review i also have to point out that there were some issues with the logic sometimes throughout the film which is really just a difficult thing to avoid when you're kind of working with a complicated premise like this. And you can really tell while watching the film that Shyamalan was actually trying to cover as much ground as possible without leaving much on the table. But there were still a few slip ups, unfortunately, and also some unanswered questions. But there's some information that's revealed later in the film that kind of covers issues that happen early in the movie that appear more so as flaws. But even then, it was still not very satisfying, I'll say. So yeah, I'll say that those were some things to kind of look out for you know if you see some logical errors or just some issues with character choices and things like that uh they were trying their best to kind of get through it without uh having too many slip ups and too many unanswered questions which i was okay with for the most part so i'm giving old an 8 out of 10 shit i enjoyed it 
It is super suspenseful and entertaining and kind of wacky and hilarious at times. There's even a funny joke about how black people age compared to everyone else. And honestly, I am very happy that Shyamalan didn't miss the opportunity to plug this joke into the film. Like, it was funny as hell. But anyway, old releases tomorrow everywhere in theaters, and there you have it. If you enjoyed the content, you know what to do. Thank you for watching.